I want to ask you about chroming. We've been seen a photograph of a man three o'clock in the afternoon, Yarraville Station, openly chroming, sitting on one of the platform seats, which we've shown you. It's on our mm. website too, three mm. w dot com dot au. Uh, years ago, this was a pub problem, chroming in public. Is it back? Um, look, it was a bigger problem probably five or six years ago. Um, it's not. It's never totally gone away. Um, it's treated as a public health issue, Neil. So we've got powers to um, search people under the age of eighteen for um, you know substances that they might use to chrome. We can take the substances off them, and we can detain them to make sure that they're okay. So, f for instance, we don't want people who are, have chromed wandering off into the traffic and things like that. So we've got an ability to detain them. But uh, are they breaking a law? They're not actually breaking a law. No, it's actually treated as a public health issue. Um, it's mainly young people who do this. It's obviously of concern, but we've done things around trying to tighten sale of the sorts of things that they might use to chrome to, to underage people. Um, so it's really, it's a public health approach that we take. I understand, you know, I find it really um, quite shocking that people would want to do that to themselves. I understand from a public point of view, people don't like seeing it and it causes um, them concern. Uh, understandably, it's a, a very risky thing for the young person to do. And sadly, from time to time, um, if they are under the influence of something, they can do, you know, dangerous things to themselves or to other people. Does it need to be illegal? Yeah, look, we had this discussion, um, I think, back in about 2004. There was a very, uh, quite a public debate about this. Um, where the government finished up at that time was to make it a, uh, as I say, a public health issue, because it is primarily people under 18. So there is, you know, um, an argument around, do we really want to criminalise those young people? Uh, look, at the end of the day, it's um, it's ultimately a matter for the government in terms of what their policy settings are around this. Our job is then simply to enforce whatever laws are in place, and that's what we're doing at the moment. Fair enough. But if you if a police officer sees somebody chroming in public, there's no problem. They can intervene. And oh, absolutely, it. and mm. we do. Um, because it's really it's a, it's a public safety issue, both for the young person, but also we're very conscious that if they are under the influence of something, they may then act in a way that's dangerous to themselves or someone else. So we would always step in and intervene.